Hi, this is Melanie of Pradesi Reviews, and I'm here to do a review of the new Hindi film, Gerayan. If you're new to Pradesi Reviews, I do film reviews and trailer reactions of Indian cinema. This film came out on Amazon Prime Video, and it is a tour de force by Deepika Padukone. It had an intriguing trailer. The title means depths, and we see, you know, big ocean waves in the trailer. We see that Deepika is having some sort of a affair with um, her cousin's fiance. I was like, wow, <laughs> this is going to be a different kind of movie, especially because the director writer is Shakun Bhatra, who gave us Kapoor and Sons, one of my favorite, favorite films. He also did Ekbein or Ek 2, uh, which is a delightful uh, romantic comedy, too. He has the same uh, writing team um, from Kapoor and Sons that co-wrote the script with him on this film. And evidently he was influenced by Woody Allen's Hannah and Her Sisters. I don't know that this film has the same kind of biting humor that a Woody Allen film has. It's, I mean, when I looked at the runtime, I'm like two hours and 40 minutes. Wow. <laughs> so I will just say, you know, the film has a very involved plot and gets very intense, you know, and because you're watching at home, you can take a break, which is what I did. I, I had, because I got phone calls and whatever, I had to take a break and watch it over two days. There's no song breaks. I mean, there's only one, I guess there's one sort of montage song, <laughs> you know, in the middle. So there's, you know, it's not like the length of the film is because it's padded with six big news, musical numbers or something. I, I was very surprised with the direction that the plot took. And, you know, when I look back on it, maybe I shouldn't be, but it's a very, at times, very noir feeling. The, I mean, the center of it is Deepika Padukone. She just really sells... Alicia is someone who does some dubious things. I mean, I mean, it's in the trailer that she's having an affair, okay? But just her choices that she she makes, her character's choices, I just found I don't know, just quite compelling, and and just the way that she played it, her, the her relationship that she has with her father, played by Nazareth and Shah. I was really struck that you know there's just fine performances all around. Ananya Pandey, I think this is the best I've ever seen her, and then um, Siddhar Chattraverdi, who I haven't seen, Bunty or Barbley too. So the last thing I saw him in was Gully Boy, and wow, <laughs> he has come a long way. Like, he really sells this almost a con man, you know, real estate hustler kind of a person, Zane, this character, and in the scenes that he has with Deepika, I mean, they are justifiably steamy. Wow. <laughs> it's interesting that this film went straight to streaming, I'm wondering what the censors would have done with it if it had been coming out in theaters. I don't know. I mean, like I said, it's got pretty steamy scenes. They're saying the F word every other sentence. I don't know. And then there was a new to me character who is uh, Deepika Padukone's longtime uh, boyfriend at the beginning of the film, Daria Karva. And I thought he was particularly good. There was one, he's this writer who who just keeps writing this novel and never finishing. And so Deepika's character is having to support the, the household, their household as a yoga instructor. Meanwhile, her cousin Tia is living the very wealth, a very wealthy life and has this boyfriend, who, Zane, with a yacht <laughs> you know, that he's renting and everything. But anyway, the, the character of Karen that um, Deepika's a boyfriend he wears a t-shirt at one point that says, I'll do it tomorrow or something like that, which is just kind of their relationship in a nutshell. She's constantly like, can you do something around the house? I'm the one working. And then he's just like, yeah, I'll, do, I'll take the trash out tomorrow. <laughs> it's definitely a film worth seeing. I will say, again, it's kind of long. 
it could have maybe used, I, I just kept thinking about the levity that, while well, Kapoor and Sense also had very meaty subject matter to it, had moments of levity and lightness. And this one sometimes just felt so overwhelmingly uh, dark, but I it took twists that I was, was not expecting. Let's just put it that way. Many twists that I wasn't expecting, although there were certain things from Dipika's past that you can see just have influenced her entire, her character's entire life that I guessed pretty much um, from near the beginning. But it was very interesting how she learned those family secrets. Again, like the... The title, it's just, you know, different characters are carrying different secrets um, from each other, from the past, from the here and now. It's, um, it's fascinating. Um, also, one of the supporting players was Rajat Kapoor, who played the father in Kapoor and Sons. He's a business partner of... Uh, Sedan's character so uh, good to see good to see him again on that in a kind of a meaty role he gets a very intense scene with Dipika late in the film <laughs> it was quite striking anyway definitely a film worth seeing really nice to have Hindi city cinema this is a Dharma production like hearing that the Dharma music at the beginning of the film was like, oh. <laughs> you know, so it was really nice to have an intense drama film from Dharma Studios to watch. Let me know if you saw this film, what you thought about it in the comments below. Follow me on Twitter at PartyZYT. Follow me on Instagram at Pradesi Reviews. And if you hit the bell here when you subscribe, you'll never miss another trailer action or film review.